Well, we managed to save uh, Josie here. Awesome. And we also got some more augmentation points. Uh, I really think that hacking was probably my best bets. Let's see here. Increases the chances of detection when capturing or fortifying nodes. See, that could be very helpful. So it's going to give me a 15% uh, decrease there. That's kind of helpful. Especially after all the uh, detection that we went through. However, I can't hack anything at level 2 right now without getting this. that allows me to analyze what something is before I uh, before I get to it. Analyze if I'm going to get detected. That's nice, but... Hmm. Let's see here. Adds one point to a node's rating. That's kind of nice. So we'll add two points to a node's rating and three points to a node's rating. This could be helpful too. to be able to hack stronger stuff. So I think I'm going to get this. For the moment, anyway. So, uh, next practice is going to be in 3035. It's not too far away now. I need to buy some practice, let me tell you. Or, uh, how much money I've got. What is this? I guess it was just hovering over it. For whatever reason, it looked like it was something completely different. Wow, these beers don't stack. I would really love to sell these beers because I am getting full on junk. I hope I can sell stuff somewhere. Alright, let's talk to Josie. Are you alright? I'm fine. I'm fine. Just a little shaken up, but... What about the other hostages? My husband was with them in one of the assembly labs, and I overheard talk about a bomb. I'm sorry. None of the other hostages survived. No. No. It can't be true. Where were the police? Why didn't they come in? They could have saved him. I'm sorry. <laughs> Well, that sucks. I at least managed to save her, though. Right? Fuck. Alright. Well, I gotta, I gotta work on uh, moving a little bit faster. Because obviously there are some major timed events that are going to screw me over here. Um, and this is talking about getting into her computer. This is new? Oh, this is just stuff I found a little while ago. I see. Let's go and get all these out of here. Alright. Looks like that's all red. Cool. I want to see what's on this computer. And I want to hack it instead of using the password. Didn't we do this one already? This looks really familiar. Awful familiar. Access granted. Alright. Crisis situation. Josie, as you know, we're in dire straits here. We need to fill several large orders for the alphabet agencies, the Typhoon being just the first of them. We depend on these contracts for a significant or for a significant portion of our revenue, meaning that successful on-time production and delivery of these orders is absolutely necessary to maintain our bottom line. 
it is extremely important we make the necessary preparations to ramp up production and pl in the plant. I'm going to need a detailed overview of this month's production schedule by the end of the day tomorrow. Sorry about the last minute request, but I'm confident you know the drill. I have faith that if we knuckle down and pull together, we'll knock this one out of the park, David. Urgent response needed. Attention, the president slash CEO. Dear sir, confidential business proposal. Having consulted with my colleagues and based on the information I have gathered from Nigerian Chambers of Commerce and Industry, awesome spam mail, I have the privilege to request for your assistance to transfer the sum of 47 a uh, million five hundred thousand uh, dollars into your accounts. The above sum resulted from an over invoice contract <laughs> executed, commissioned, and paid for about five years ago by a foreign contractor. This action was, however, intentional and since then the fund has been in a suspense account at the Central Bank of Nigeria Apex Bank. We now are ready to transfer the fund overseas and that is where you come in. It is important to inform you that as civil servants we are forbidden to operate a for a foreign account. That is why we require your assistance. The total sum will be shared as follows. 70 for us, 25 for you, and 5 for local and international expense expenses incidents to the transfer. The transfer is risk-free on both sides bullshit. I am an accounts accountant with the Nigerian National uh, Trans Transhumanism Corporation in NTC. If you find this proposal acceptable, we shall require the following documents. Your banker's name, telephone, account, and fax numbers, your private telephone and fax numbers for confidentiality and easy communication, your letterhead, paper, stamped, and signed. Alternatively, we will furnish you with the text of what to type into your letter-headed paper along with a breakdown explaining comprehensively what we require of you. The business will take us 30 working days to accomplish. Please reply urgently. Yeah, that is definitely spam mail. And whoever replies to something like that thinking that it's true really doesn't know what's going on on the internets at all. <sighs> Sorry, Josie. Didn't mean to get everyone killed. That is totally my fault. You guys are trying to bust down the door. Come on, Wilson. <laughs> this is kind of sad. Nice job securing the plant. Gonna lose the bastard. I wouldn't have thought a security guard could handle this. Not even an augmented one. You, Sarah's boy? What the hell happened in there? I thought you were supposed to handle the situation. God. I, I sort of did. How the hell did you let the bastard get away? You dropped the ball, pal. Well, I let him get away because there was a good reason. I can't believe they made us wait out here while the leader of these assholes got away. Who knows what he'll do now? Way to secure the terrorist leader, Jensen. Now the bastard's free to spread his lies and cause more trouble. Whatever. He's got some issues, but he was kind of tricked here. So, you're the reason we were kept out of here. All your little secrets are locked away good and tight. Eh, shut it. So I guess we just need to go back to the helicopter at this point. I guess that's what we'll do. Hey, how's it going? Not quite what you signed up for, is it, Jensen? Excuse me? Sneaking into your own factory to hide stuff while the boss holds the cops at bay? Don't get me wrong, I love Mr. Seraph. I just hate it when contracts become more important than people. I thought you did too. Well, things don't always go according to plan, we'll go with that. I do. But things don't always go according to plan, Malik. 
I did what I could. I... I'm sure you did. You ready to go? Yeah. Well, you know what? Not yet. Not quite yet, Malik. Can you wait here? Yeah, but don't take too long. Boss is expecting you. I kind of wonder if I can go back. And if I can, maybe I can uh, uncover some stuff that I missed. Just out of curiosity. Because there were a lot of places to look over. Oh, and the uh, police are in here too. I wouldn't have thought a security guard could handle this. Not even an augmented one. Cool. Yeah, there's a lot of police in here now. I might very well be able to go back and snatch just about everything that we may or may not have missed. Just because of the fact that there's police everywhere now. This could be somewhat lucrative. Yeah, it's beginning to look like I can go back anywhere. Whoa. Guys, okay, checking out that guy. Figuring out what's going on. Anything here that I might have missed? Does not look like it. Definitely did not get to uh, search through this area before. So let's check it out. Nice. I definitely can come back and get items. Oh yeah, totally worth it to come back and get items. Plus I might get some um, experience if I can find computers to hack or uh, grates to go through. Cool. Hello, what's this? Revolver ammo. So I guess there's uh, something to be said about not going and being greedy, because I probably could have got through this entire place silently and uh, came back later to get all the junk. Anything else in here? It does not look like it. That's where I went through. Dude, are you sneezing on me? So yeah, that's apparently just uh, some decontamination kind of thing. Whoa. Human activists have raided a Seraph Industries plant. Factory workers have been... Shush. If I'm going to be reading anything, I need that off. Ooh, what do we got here? Uh, nothing. Already seen that. Hello? Don't think we've seen this. Seraph Industries rising to tomorrow. How did we get here? David Seraph had a dream that one day he would create a technology that would change the world and his company would be the crucible 
where that would happen. In 2007, Seraph Industries opened its doors in Detroit, working in partnership with the city to revitalize it with an influx of new technology. Blech. Technology Industries. Serif's research and development of augmentations are a measure of human advancement toward a better future, and our founder's reputation as a free thinker and a maverick has allowed him to recruit a staff of like-minded geniuses gathering the kinds of nonconformist scientists that, like David Seraph, have never truly been able to function in regimented corporate in a regimented corporate environment. Regimented? Okay, whatever. Um, in the past two decades, Seraph Industries has generated a reputation for originality and innovation in the business and science communities. We check this out. Yep. Gotta make sure though. Never know. Now, I think there's some reward for finding all the ebooks that there are in this game. I could be wrong. It could be something completely different. What's up? Random camera. This one moving? Doesn't look like it. Um, that's where I came from. That's one thing I don't like is that these, uh, these doors close so I can't tell if I've been through them. Um, this is back the way that I came. So, nothing there. Let's see here. Assembly line 2 and server room. Head over this way. Come on. There we go. Anything good in here? Does not look like it. Hold on, is this the... I got turned around somehow. This is the place that we came from. I am confused. Alright. So, assembly line 2 and server room are not the way I want to go. I want to get to assembly line one, actually. Huh. I thought this was a place that uh, I was going back to. Apparently this is not what I thought it was. <laughs> 